biggest disconnects that I see that predispose shoulder injuries to lifters is the lack of centration at the shoulder. So getting in a nice central position where the ball and socket joint, the head of the humerus here in that glenoid fossa is in a nice and neutral position. So the way that we work into this is something called the synergistic spiral effect. So what we're doing is spiraling down all of the joints from the upper extremity into the shoulder to create a central and neutral position that's both good for performance and also orthopedic health. So this can also be described as creating torque through the system. The first thing I do to teach this is drop down on all fours in a quadruped position and I start people's hands down on the ground here. To get an appreciation for what I'm talking about is I try to get these elbows to shoot out towards the front. So we're really gonna spiral everything around and almost grip the floor. So what this does is positions the wrist, the elbow, and the shoulder joint at the neutral position so we can stay stacked. Let me show a couple reps here of getting into this position. Stacked, unstacked. Stacked, unstacked. So what we do from there is work the eccentric portion of a push-up, really to maintain that stacked position, that shoulder-centrated position. So getting into a good position, stacked, bringing the legs back, and maintaining this position all the way down under control. From there, we can enhance the push-up one more time, coming up into the concentric as well. Stacking the shoulders, legs back, control it on the way down, and control it on the way up, all in that stacked position. And that's how to keep the synergistic spiral effect working for you to bulletproof the shoulders.